Sending the clowns, right? <laughs> Don't bother, we're here. Kicking in my agent suit shirt from my days with Ringling Brothers. And today's lesson, Paul Miller, social circus, activist, pioneer, few initials, T-R-O-B-O-D-L-3-C, okay? T-R-O, temporary restraining order. <gasps> B-O-D, board of directors. <sighs> L-3-C, low profit, limited liability company. Hmm. Okay, so clowns, there's a few clowns, uh, some folks I've met, some folks have trained me, some folks are friends of mine, Pasoni, Merman, Miller. Pickle Family Circus, Circus Mercus, Circus Team. Guess what? Clowns have problems with authority. Clowns challenge the ringmaster, okay? That's what's funny. When clowns challenge a board of directors, guess what? Not very funny. They get fired. Larry Pasoni made a word, I love the word, clownfrontational, okay? Can clowns be <laughs> clownfrontational in a funny way, right? So, Circus Team fired me, uh, and they filed a lawsuit against me for trademark infringement. Remember, the ideas were mine, but I put them in the name of the organization, so suddenly if I'm using, I'm infringing, okay? Also, I gave some trade secrets, like, oh, I told them people how to spin plates or who donated money. Trade secrets? It's not like, you know, figured out the cure for cancer, all right? Oh, cyber piracy, Arr, matey. Uh, I bought websites that were similar to Circus Theme, and my wife, will never forgive me for that one, okay? If there was one stupid thing I did, I bought some websites. Boy, they drug GoDaddy and everybody into this mess. I work to settle out of court. I don't believe in fighting. Ask any person who's worked with me in circus, and all the circuses I work with are nonviolent. I believe in discussing matters. I do not believe in fighting. Why on earth would I tear down something that so many people helped me create? Would I not look ungrateful? All right, back to Circus Mojo, okay? I have a right to protect myself, all right? I created a great project. The board of directors sued me. They made a lot of problems and headaches. So I have a right to protect myself, hence I did some research. I've been working hard. I set up a low profit, limited liability company in the state of Vermont, an L3C, which is a hybrid of a for-profit and non-profit venture. Foundations can invest or make a grant they need to spend 5% of their total net worth every year in what's called PRIs. Ooh, I didn't even put those initials, and the chalk is out, but I'm going to put it up there for people. PRI, Program Related Investments. Foundations can make PRIs, Program Related Investments, in Circus Mojo, Low Profit Limited Liability Company. How about that? Okay? Instead of dealing with the board of directors who may shift from time to time, may question why you painted this room this color blue, why didn't you paint it my color blue, I don't have time for that, okay? So I partner with nonprofits that have been around for a long time, that have strong boards of directors, strong financial underpinnings, group like Cincinnati Children's Hospital, where we work twice a week bringing circus to kids in waiting rooms, doctors, patients, staff, custodians, we bring the circus there. We worked against the Kentucky Symphony Orchestra for a big circus that we produced with them last year. Fantastic event. We work at the Hamilton County Juvenile Justice Department, trying to work on giving kids some skills so they don't end up back in detention. Art Rages, University of Cincinnati, producing shows there. Do programs for little people. These are my two kids, Hope and Lou, all right, putting them to work. Circus Silly Willy, giving young people something to focus on besides this or Barney or whatever they're watching these days. All right, Circus Mojo is a project for all ages and abilities, all ages and abilities. We work with Catholic Residential Services. These are adults in wheelchairs, okay? And most social service agencies, when I said, hey, let's bring the circus to your group, they said, eh, these people have been exploited in the past in the sideshow. We don't think circus mixes well with people who are disabled. And I respect that point of view. That's a board of directors really thinking about an image, okay? And that's their job, okay? But a group called Catholic Residential Services, they came to us and they said, we'd like to do circus with you. Can you do that? And we said, absolutely. That's why right over here, come on, come with me, cameraman. I put in a bathroom, an ADA bathroom, Americans with Disabilities bathroom. How cool is it? I build the bathroom here at the Circus Mojo. This is the studio. And they come. Build it and they will come. You heard that phrase, right? So here we have a class, seven weeks long 
for adults in wheelchairs. You want to talk about a group of people who nobody really cares about? It's a bunch of adults in wheelchairs, okay? They can't care about kids at Children's Hospital. They care about a lot of different scenarios. But here we are working with adults. They love it. The whole group's participating. Now we're doing a second six-week class. We have 16 participants in the program. It's fantastic. So Circus Mojo is a social circus. It's in the status of a low-profit, limited liability company. I'm actively seeking investors, foundations, partners to help replicate this work, to study the work, and to train the work. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. Send in the clowns. We know the clowns have an important role in society, okay? The clowns, or the jester, would always challenge the king, would make fun of the king, would mock the king. Everyone would laugh, and then that's how the king would control the court, okay? Forever. Clowns have had roles in society. They're very important roles. Political commentator Dan Rice, he was a very famous clown here. I want you. He's the Uncle Sam icon that we all see today. Clowns go back throughout history. And here I am, a clown in Ludlow, Kentucky, working on a low-profit, limited liability company, bringing circus to all ages and abilities. Join us at Circus Mojo. Come participate. Be a part of this project. Thank you. Give me a call.